Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. For this week we are going to be testing out Instagram's art hacks. Some of them I believe in and others not so much. So let's get on with it. So the first hack is to help avoid acrylic paint drying on you while you're in the middle of painting something. This has happened so many times I I I get so frustrated. So I actually don't know if this one's going to work. It doesn't sound that believing, but we'll see. So you're first going to just take a wet paper towel, as you can tell. Um, this is just a little bit wet. I mean, it's pretty wet. like. And then you just put paint on it. So I already have done that. And this is one of my fastest drying paints. And in the meantime, I'm going to take it and put it in the regular palette that I use the same amount roughly as you can tell so we're gonna just see how long it takes to you know see if this one dries out faster than this one because that's the whole test this is what it looks like after approximately 14 minutes as you can tell it is starting to dry just a little bit around the edges but there's still a good amount and as you can tell this one also it's this one is a little bit goopier however this one it didn't dry at all like at all like it didn't dry one bit it is still thin but it, it's honestly actually it's still kind of goopy so personally i don't think this one worked this one i think is a thumbs down this one definitely i don't think it matters i think it you're just better off taking the acrylic and putting it in your palette because it didn't dry at all um, this one, it soaked up more of the paint, so you got less paint, and it still um, became a goopy consistency like the one in the palette, so. Okay, so the next hack is if, you know, when you are painting or drawing and you accidentally, like, always bump your paint brushes around. So, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a piece of paper. Um, you probably want like a thick cardstock. This is just some extra pieces of cardstock that I found laying around. And then you're going, you're going to create the fan effect. So fold it and then you fold it the other way until you have something that looks like this. And then you can put your paint brushes in here instead so now when you are bumping around it only moves this piece of paper i think i think this one it's a thumbs okay. up so the next hack i have moved you to a different angle and this is because i don't know just, it's going to be easier so this is a cup of water and this is what happens when you leave that paintbrush in the water as you can tell, it is bent, it's curved, because you leave it in the cup like this for who knows how long, and then you can't use it again, because it's, it's, it's dead, it's sad. So, to avoid this, you're going to take a piece of cardboard, this is the same exact cardstock as I used for the last hack, but I don't think it should matter, and you're basically just going to put some holes in it. So... Basically, now that you have a little tiny hole, you're going to... Oh, there was lightning. There was lightning. <laughs> you're going to take your paintbrush and put it through the hole. And depending on how tall your cup is, you can stick the paintbrush in your cup as so like so and it won't fully touch the bottom like it can just hang in the water 
without it actually touching and making the hairs in your brush bend because that's sad. So I think this hack is also a thumbs up. It worked. It was great. I would definitely use this. The next hack, it's not really like an art hack, but if you like to film videos and you don't have a tripod or anything, then this could work. However, it might not work for everyone because quite frankly, it doesn't really work for me. Um, but you take a cup, preferably not your water cup, and you're going to take your phone or your any filming device. I'm just taking my phone and you can just go into your camera and you place your phone on the cup. Now, the reason why I say it doesn't work on mine, you can tell that this cup right here is in the way. When I'm filming, the cup is in the way and I have all the space. Like, if I get my ruler, I will measure how much space I have. Less than four inches. I have three inches, like three and a half inches for my hand, and I only have a little bit of space to actually do my work. It can work, but I'm just worried about space. Like, the space is the only thing I'm worried about. I don't think it's possible to draw or paint or do something like with this much space and three inches tall personally if you're going to do that find something a little bit taller like even this plant um it might work i don't know this one i'm giving it a sideways thumb it might work you might just need to do some extra things to make it suit you anyways guys so that was all the hacks that i had I could do more if you wanted to, so if you like that idea, I could do markers, I could do pencil, digital art hacks, like any of those, honestly. But yeah, that was it, so please like and subscribe if you would like to. You know, not necessary, but it could help me out, um, so goodbye.